My question to you this morning is, what are your expectations on a guided waterfowl hunt? Ponder that. Day 44 of 60. And my question to you is, if you've been on a guided hunt, you've been thinking about going on a guided hunt, or if you've never been on a guided hunt, what does a guided hunt imply? Does it imply shooting? Does it imply limits? Does it imply guaranteed birds? Yeah, Raj, Raj with me this morning. Yeah, so I mean, those are the things that always go through my mind. I am sitting here this morning. I had to come check out the weather. I, it had been blowing. I wants to get out and go run around. It had been blowing uh, pretty much all day yesterday, straight out of the north. And the ocean, from all good accounts, yesterday was a mess. And then overnight, it actually has got a little bit of east in it. But um, I still needed to. My alarm did not go off at 2 a.m. like it normally does. I was just going to play it by ear. I think I ended up waking up and I got out of bed at 3.15, so went to Wawa, start my morning off like I always do. Side note, Ride loves scrambled eggs and she didn't like the new Wawa everything seasoning. I think it was, had a little bit too much garlic in it for her, so I enjoyed the eggs, though. But yeah, the trials and tribulations of being, how about this, at least being an open water guide, a sea duck guide, um, someone, a guide who depends on the weather as far as being in open water. So the other aspect too is, and I've gone sea ducks many, many different locations and to be a hundred percent legal in Maryland, you've got to be at least 800 yards from any land. Rise investigating the scrambled eggs maybe for a second time. <laughs> but yeah, you got to be 800 yards from any land. So much like up north when I've been, you can get out on rocks. You can, even if you're in a boat, you can get in the lee of a little island, a little rock island. You can, you can get yourself on a beach out, out west, Washington. You can get yourself on a beach and do it. And here in Maryland, you just can't. So that's part of the special sea duck season. And the special sea duck, it's not really special. It's part of the sea duck zone. Special sea duck season. And in Maryland, we have a sea duck zone. The sea duck zone basically is you've got to be at least 800 yards from any land. All right, I'm rambling and I'm scrambling. Back to my point. My question to you is, what does a guided hunt mean to you? And I, as I started to say this, I, I kind of got off sidetracked. But I kind of think uh, as far as from my perspective, me canceling the hunt or at least giving them the option to cancel speaks of my, uh, I'm, of my integrity. Um, I'm, I won't say worried, but I'm definitely conscious of my name and my brand. And I always want to treat somebody the way that I'd want to be treated. So a couple text messages turned into phone calls. And, and basically, I just gave them the option saying, I don't think it's a good idea. And if you're going to get on me and saying that we have, op I should have different options. I do I have definitely two different good options. Well, let me rewind. Generally, they are a good B and C option. But this year, with it being, although it's not that, not that mild this morning, with it being mild, the birds just aren't really there. So, um... And in my mind, we would just go and sit and not really get any shooting. So I'm not, I'm not looking to, I'm not a thief. I'm not looking to rob people. So if somebody really, really wanted to go and sit today, let's say it was a, a three day hunt and they said, Hey man, I understand. Let's go do it. And they were here anyway. That's one thing. But guys that are traveling down overnight for a one day hunt, which was what today would be this week. I have all single day hunts anyway. Uh, hey. A very Merry Christmas week to you. I should have started off the video that way. I'm sorry. But yeah, if it was a multi-day hunt, definitely I, I would have guys that would probably say, hey, yeah, we're here. Let's go do it anyway. But for guys to travel, for it to be, as I like to say, not as advertised. I'm not into that. So, But again, I'll leave it up to you. Please comments down below. What does a guided, I was going to say guided sea duck hunt, a guided hunt, a guided waterfowl hunt, period. What is a... Uh, What's that mean to you and what, what are your expectations? So appreciate you following along. Thank you very much. I'm going to let Rye run real quick. Karen's already texting me. She's awake. 
and I uh, do want to get do want to get home and um, see her before she leaves to go to work. So um, I'll get this edited, get this up. I've got day 39, 40, 41. I've got those in the works. I'll get them up also. And uh, I feel like I'm just rambling. So, all right. A very happy Monday. It's not that happy for me, but very happy Monday to you. What should be day 44 of 60, Sea Duck Hunting, right here in Maryland. Thinking of you, we are.